Now it's been a wild week for Mia Khalifa, who although she's long been retired from the adult industry, well she still manages to go viral every now and then, and this week for two entirely different reasons. Now first off, there was her trip to the plastic surgeon, this got a whole lot of attention. And then there was her death hoax, now this picked up some serious traffic, to which she finally responded where she stated, Please don't think I'm not keeping track of each of my friends that haven't said condolence flowers yet. I see you twats. Thankfully she is alive and well, and she's got a whole new look that she'll be showing off at her upcoming wedding. Now I'm sad to report that I will not be the man who is being asked to walk down the aisle with her even though I did put myself out there and proposed to her a couple years back. The video's cringe, but it's worth a watch. I guess what I'm saying, Mia Khalifa, if that is your real name, which I'm almost pretty certain it is not, but whatever. Will you marry me? Also, try and get back to me ASAP, because this like is a first come, first serve situation. I've also asked Lindsay Pellis and she might say yes. Now Mia Khalifa has always been a fan favorite here on this channel. It's kind of like Dude Perfect doing trick shots, PewDiePie doing meme review, or Mr. Beast giving away money. Me creeping on Mia Khalifa, it's kind of embedded into the algorithm of this channel. So I thought I'd give you guys a full update on everything that's going on with her. Now this is an episode of Famous News, we do these once in a while, and if you're new, be sure to subscribe to the Fame Gang. All right, now let's get into this video. I have no I'm in the hospital. Oh, you lie so much Let's send the location. I'm number one. Okay, now Mia Khalifa is obviously one who isn't afraid to go under the knife. Now she got her boobs done, which led to her work in the adult industry. And then believe it or not, she actually got hit by a flying hockey puck at an NHL game. And then she had to get one of them repaired. Can you imagine that? We're built on igloo <laughs> to protect ourselves. <laughs> from polar bears and flying hockey pucks. Now she's also been through a massive body transformation, shedding all sorts of weight, and she's uh, been keeping her fans updated on all her progress. If you follow her on Instagram, you'll see that she's been putting in the work. No other updates in her life, they include her engagement to chef Robert Sandberg. She's also got an upcoming wedding. And uh, well, I can't believe she plans on wearing white. Ah, I'm just joking, I'm just joking. Yeah. Now following the death hoax that went viral via Twitter, well word got out that she had gone under the knife opting for a rhinoplasty, and that again, it had her name making news. Now she's got over 8 million followers on TikTok, and she posted a video which foreshadowed the procedure, and this clocked in a whopping 17.9 million views at the time of this recording. Now she also opened up on social media where she revealed, This is the real rebrand, Deepak Dugard, MD. Just changed my life, and I couldn't be happier or more ready for the 75 plus people to stare at my side profile at my wedding. This is day two post-op, and I have a pain scale of zero so far. I'm gonna take you on this whole process with me, and so is Deepak, so follow him for the Q&As we did for you about my hopes and expectations. What I love was that we were on the same page about maintaining my strong Middle Eastern nose, just softening it to be more feminine. I can't wait to show you all the results. P.S. Being transparent about this was never a question. Do not idolize the women you see on social media and base your self-worth on comparisons that are unrealistic. If you've ever looked at my boobs and wish you looked like that, please remember mine are made out of the same material as the spatula in your kitchen drawer. Now Mia's openness about the procedure and led some online fans to make accusations that she was throwing shade at another social media star, i.e. Madison Beer. Now she's thought to have gotten some work done herself to her nose, but that's something that she wants to keep a little on the DL. I don't know. Now we've yet to do it before they're famous on Madison Beer, so if that's something you want us to get done, let us know in the comments down below. Now Mia, she also promoted YouTube's OG Philip DeFranco, where he talked about her making the news and her recent procedure. Sharing some of her old interviews and writing things like, Mia Khalifa was only in the adult entertainment industry for three months, was barely compensated for the amount of money her videos have brought in, and has been shamed within our society. And that in part in reference to a comment Mia made last year saying she only made a total of around $12,000 while working in the industry. Now that $12,000 part, it actually really hits hard. I'm not gonna lie, we've made more on Mia Khalifa's videos that she actually made on her entire adult career. Uh, and her nose job, I believe that was something around $15,000. Now I got a feeling Mia Khalifa might actually watch this video, and if she does, I have a proposition for her. Now what I have here is a giant check. That's right, one of them. <laughs> we got one off Amazon, and uh, I'll make this legit. Now if me and Mia were to collab, and if history is anything to go by, well, we could probably hit number one on trending. I mean, she is ingrained into the algorithm of this channel. My audience loves her. Our names just go together like peanut butter and jelly. 
So Mia, next time you are in Toronto, if we sit down and do a collab video, well, I'm gonna give you all the proceeds and it could be a whole lot of money. Also, uh, if your man wants to get in on it, I'd love to do it before they're famous on him. Just invite me to the wedding. I'll come with the chat. All right, that's all I got for you guys in this one. It's short and sweet. Be sure to follow me over on Twitter because I've been going off and giving you guys a lot of information that's going on behind the scenes. All right, that's all I got. I'll see you guys in another video. Go!